here at home where it's been a rough start to the new year for a family in Parker. When storms blew through this morning, lightning struck their home. Vanessa Brown is in Glen Meadows Drive with a look at the damage there. A couple and their three kids were inside sleeping when they heard that lightning crack and ran for safety. It only took minutes for everything they owned to go up in flames. Six neighboring departments battled this blaze, but there wasn't much they could do to stop it. The couple says the 6 a.m. strike sent the smoke detectors off almost immediately and that by the time help arrived, the entire home was burning. Parker's chief says it was too dangerous to put firefighters inside. He says lightning strikes are common in this area, and a few years back, experts even determined the soil and elevation here play a role. My heart went out to, to our neighbors when I came out this morning and saw the fire, uh, you know, coming up to the roof. Uh, just know how hard it is once, you know, you have to kind of rebuild this part of your material life. Unfortunately, when fire uh, gets into the attic of homes this large, this is typically the result you'll see. All that's left is what you see on the lawn and whatever pictures they can salvage. The mom has her cell phone and they were also able to retrieve some albums. By the way, the chief says most homes in this area don't have lightning rods. He says that's something worth looking into. In Parker, Vanessa Brown, CBS 11 News.